It's time to persona all over the place. No school today. Time for the home shopping show, which we have tons of money now. So we are good to go. Uh, the theater is packed today. Urgently looking for someone who can work as fast as an action movie protagonist. Wait, that's me, I'm the protagonist. But we need to talk to the actual protagonists first and get some really fancy products. Hello everyone! Welcome to the home shopping show Tanaka's Amazing Commodities! I'm your host Tanaka with a live presentation of my amazing commodities! We'll show you great products at unbeatable prices. So don't touch that dial, because you won't want to miss these! I'm going to do it! Today we're introducing the beginner's home cooking set! Hell yeah, we'll be able to use the fucking kitchen! Have you been dreaming about learning to cook but don't know where to start? I've been dreaming, and I know exactly where to start! Well, look no further! First up, we have the all-purpose apron! It's just armor. They lied to me. Put this on and it'll turn you into a first-class chef! Lies! Deception! Liar! <laughs> You're with him! You brought him here to kill me! <laughs> oh my goodness, it's wonderful! But wait, there's more! We'll throw in this Umugi water too! Guess how many? Two! All oh, this for just 5,980 yen. This is a special limited product available today only. You heard right, today only! Thanks, kid. <laughs> that was the creepiest Tanaka line we've had thus far. <laughs> Thanks, kid. <laughs> Next time, we'll be introducing a healthy lifestyle set. Don't bait me again, Tanaka. Don't bait me. Healthy lifestyle? Don't miss it. That's it for today, folks. We're all sold out. Sorry, folks. Bye -bye. I want to scream into my pillow. Ah! On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R. Episode 14, a love bomb. Sometimes the only strategy for victory is an abject apology. On to today's news. I'm not apologizing. I want my goddamn kitchen. I've been waiting for you. Yeah. Regarding my request to have you escort me to various locations in this world, I would like you to show me around this Polonia Mall first. I'm looking forward to if it. If you have the time, then please come fetch me so long as the sun is out. How may I assist you? Yeah, let's uh, let's take you out. Yeah. My. I've been waiting for you. I've been waiting for you to ask. Shall we be on our way? Okay. My, an encounter with one of your world's exquisite treasures, right out of the blue. Out of the blue, so nice. this is the fountain. The fountain the of life. of water, a precious resource, and the very foundation of life. Such a sinful form of art. <laughs> so sinful, yes. I've heard of its mystical powers, wherein those who offer coin may have their wishes granted. Mm-hmm. Mm, maybe so. Then I must try my hand at this. Fortunately, I anticipated this and brought a hefty sum of coins. Oh, God. 2,000 of your 500 yen coins, to be exact. Ooh. I shall make a winning bid of 1 million yen. Oh, my God. Elizabeth casually paying to win. Oh. I was so caught up in the excitement that I started tossing coins without giving my wish <laughs> any thought. This won't do. I shall give it more careful consideration before I return here in the near future. Yes. You do that while I go and become a scuba diver really quick. Hmm? What is this facility here? Hmm. I see there's a gentleman inside with quite the stern face. Yeah, he doesn't he hasn't had his donut yet. And these photographs displayed so prominently most wanted. Reward. Hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Would it be correct to presume that these are your version of my subjugation requests? Essentially. Yeah, yeah. Uh, pretty much. What do they use as proof that the target has been subjugated? If they truly parallel my requests, <laughs> then do they require a piece of the body? Yeah. My interest has been piqued. Uh-oh. She's going to become an agent of justice. A very violent agent of justice. <laughs> this edifice over here... Yes. Is this what you call a club? Dancers dictated by the sway of one's inner passions. A subterranean garden flourishing with uninhibited desires. Indeed. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, no! It's closed right now? Oh, what a pity. I had hoped to become part of the scene. <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> well, that was quite satisfying. <laughs> Just woo. <laughs> Let's be real though, she has better dance moves than half of us. But I'm overwhelmed. Everything looks so new and inviting. Everywhere I look, something catches the eye. If you don't mind, could you perhaps recommend our next activity? Um Karaoke, for sure. Absolutely. I want to hear you go woo into the mic. Karaoke. Oh, could it be? Yes. It appears the time has come to demonstrate my hidden talents. Ah, yes. One may even challenge professional singers at the touch of a button at this karaoke. Uh, excuse me. Would you mind waiting for a moment? Uh, I hadn't noticed there was a fountain on this. Oh, side. oh no. Oh no. She's about to go dump another, like, million yen in here. Oh, yet another fountain. On the opposite side, I see. So this mm. place plays host to a trinity of fountain spirits. Yeah, hold up. Let her cook. Let her cook. <laughs> I apologize for the wait. Mm. Let us continue. Mm. <laughs> Minus three million yen. Well, I shall perform a song of exultation for my master. Sing along if you will. La, la, la. Oh my, you've never heard this song before? No, no, show it to me, I'm, I'm curious. Thank you for the invaluable no! experiences you've shared with me today. I consider this mission a complete success. This okay. may sound forward, but I'd like for you to accompany me again sometime. All right, we, 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 I, I'd be cool with that. I return to the velvet room with Elizabeth. And no time slot used. Best game ever. Flawless, 10 out of 10. Thank you for earlier. Now then, how may I be of assistance? Are you accepting a request? All right. Let's hear the results. Okay. Thank you for showing me around Polonia Mall. Regarding that fountain, I still haven't decided what to wish for. Shame. Unfortunately, my master has vetoed my wish to renovate the velvet room with a dance floor. No, Igor, no. Don't make me come in there with my personas and smack a bitch. I will, I will throw hands with you. Give Elizabeth her dance floor. I was so set on establishing club velvet that coming up with another wish has proved to be rather difficult. Club velvet? That would be, that would be amazing. Oh. Marvelous. I'll wish to come up with a wish. There, that settles it. Please take this as your reward. It's three million yen. <laughs> the acquisition of the small Chongsam, you can now fuse Wapo, the graceful tree spirit. Oh, okay. Wait, Um. how do I hang out with them? Like, do I have to find them in the like, Oh, I see. You have to accept their message. Right, right. I don't remember, but I think one of them I actually don't have enough to level up. I just wish it would show me that because I, I remember one of them I actually don't have enough to uh, to increase. Was it... I want to say it was Kenji. I think it tells you before accepting. That could be a good way to test, yeah. I'll save. Save here. I think Kenji's is not enough to... Uh, it's like, Tomoshika wants to hang out. 
I feel like as if we can grow closer. Thanks to Matt Ninja's post on a jack o' lantern. Oh, wait, so it will increase their level up. Okay, so they're both actually ready to level up. So, okay. Then I'm just gonna I'm just gonna spend time with them then. tree get cut down? What happened? Ah, uh, don't you worry. She's she's crying because she's happy. Oh, happy. She's an emotional woman. Oh. Her heart. She's been like this since the day we oh. met. You see, all the graduates from my son's class have come together. They're collecting signatures to save the persimmon tree. Oh, yes! They say the tree is a memorial to their former teacher. They don't want it to be cut down. Okay. That's great. It was the same for our son's funeral. Many of them showed up for it. It's been so many years since then, but they still remember him. They've given their precious time for our son. I, I don't know what to say. I'm so grateful. You must be the one who called on them for this, right? Ah, uh, oh, no, I didn't. No, I, I don't want to lie here. No, it wasn't me. Ah, uh, don't pretend it's just us. You don't have to be so modest. You're a samurai, a modern day samurai. Yeah. Who seems to think I'm the one responsible for the petition? They're showing considerable gratitude. And I feel like we're growing closer. <laughs> they have decided that we did it. <laughs> yes. Rank seven in any of them already is kind of wild. But this one is very easy to rank up. And before you know it, you'll graduate and step boldly into adulthood. Don't forget about us, you hear? All right. And, uh, I'd love to grab a drink, you and me. Oh. But for now, you'll have to make do with this. No. Yeah. Celio missed. See you again soon. Okay. No. Oh. Very wholesome. Let me see if anything's updated with the uh, the fortune lady. Oh, it appears there's been a change within you. Well, allow me to provide you with a new fortune befitting the unusual light that you hold within. You are now able to select the new fortune, Gamble Fortune. Increase the chance of enemies turning into stronger rare enemies. Oh, okay. Rarity fortune encountering rare enemies is more likely. But this one increased the chance of enemies turning into stronger rare enemies. Okay. Good morning. Good morning. You're as punctual as always, Espresso Kun. This morning, Junpei left earlier than usual. Looking like the world is about to end. Oh no. What happened? Yeah. Our midterm scores are going to be revealed today, so... Sadie's going to beg the teachers for a higher score before they get posted. As if that's going to work. Oh, by the way, you remember that girl Sonata-senpai was talking about? Uh, Yamagishi-san? I heard she has a weak constitution, but that's just a rumor. I don't know what she's really like. But having more people join us in our fight is good news, right? Yeah, yeah. You can get another Persona user. Hey, the exam results are up. All right, cross fingers. I'm in the top 10. Everyone is looking at me. Oh shit, charm. Let's go. All right, top 10, baby. Come to think of it, Mitsuru promised to give me a gift if I scored well. I should talk to Mitsuru when I see her. All right, good enough, yeah. So you can okay. actually check out your friend's I'm exam class. results. It might be interesting to see how their, their grades change over a year. Okay, yeah, we'll do. All right, class, settle down. You can show off your scores to each other later. Let's spend a bit of time going over the test now. The first part was the kanji dictation section. How did any of you get this part wrong? It was a gimme. I swear, you make me ashamed to be your teacher sometimes. Next was the short essay, the reaction to a passage about bullying in schools. These don't have a sole correct answer. You could write whatever comes to mind as long as it's relevant. 
You could even write about something you'd never discuss aloud, like a complaint about bullying at Gekokun, for example. But I'm sure that's not an issue in this class, right? Bear in mind, I hate cowards who resort to, resort to bullying. Damn! I'm feeling sleepy. If I close my eyes, stay awake! Okay, moving okay, on. Okay, on to the next section. Many of you got these wrong. Are we paying attention? Good. Now you are asking to write the correct conjunction in each case. The first one's answer was and, but if you wrote however, you lucked out with some partial credit. I won't award it next time though, got it? I forced myself to stay awake and listen to the lecture. Getting smarter. And there it is, baby! Ladies and gentlemen, we're above average! Above average! I'm neither happy nor disappointed with my score since it's about average. How'd you do, new guy? We did pretty well. Just like I thought. My score wasn't too bad. Guess it's a good starting point. Oh! Oh, espresso kun. I saw the exam results. You were really high up on the list. Kirijo senpai seemed impressed. Maybe she'll even give you some kind of reward. All right. Okay, we got Maiko. What are we playing today? I want to play a lot today and eat takoyaki too. Hitoshi, this is Uragiri. I have high hopes for you. It would be great if you could attend the meeting today. That's all. Shit, we've got, we got Hitoshi and Kazushi. Oh no, wait, the game lied to me. Wait, that's so lame. I knew that one of them wasn't ready to rank up. Ah. <sighs> No, but it did, it did say they're ready to rank up with this persona. It literally did, the game told me that Kenji and uh, Kazushi was ready. Let's load this, yeah. I don't have to redo any shopping. See, I'm right here. This was the part right after I did all that. So now what I'll do is I'll go here. Let's hang out with Kazushi, yeah. He's also the one that I kind of wanted to spend time with the most today, so here we go. Let's meet with him, yeah. By the way, wouldn't it be funny if all my knee problems turned out to be growing pains? But honestly, I don't want to get any bigger than I am right now. It's not like I'm gonna do any going to pro wrestling. Oh, you can have my rice if you want. Here, take it. <sighs> I'm trying to cut down on carbs. Uh, you want to diet? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I gotta watch what I eat these days so I can build muscle mass. I'll do whatever it takes to win the regionals. Remember, it's all about the mindset, espresso. Yamato has shown me his resolve. Okay. Oh, damn it! I really do want some rice. Just having it right in front of me is torture. No, I gotta snap out of it. This is perfect mental training. Go ahead and eat it, espresso. Come on, just shovel it down. I think, I think we'll just spend time with Kazushi. Time for practice, don't be skipping on me now. All right, let's go hang out with him then. Let's head to where Miyamoto is, yeah. Hey there. Yo, espresso, finally exams are over. Phew, what's the plan for today? Oh, speaking of which, you gonna head to practice today? Sorry, man, go on ahead without me. Miyamoto is acting strangely. Oh, okay, yeah, let's do this. Yeah, I'm gonna head over too, just give me a sec. Ah oh, man, don't push it. You gotta recover. I don't see Miyamoto. Yeah. Shit. Well, we're out of here. Take it easy. Okay. Good hustle out there. You'd better wrap up too. See you next practice. All right. Made my way back to the dorm after practice. Yeah, I meet him on the way back, yeah. Whoa! What's up? I was just gonna sneak back into practice. Yeah, it's over, man. Where have you been? My mom's been on my case. She took me to the hospital. She insisted after I told her about my knee. Yeah. She made the appointment without telling me, so there was nothing I could do. Yeah, that really sucks. Oh, no, how did it go? How did it go? Hell if I know. Uh, sorry. I know you're just worried about me. 
Today they took some x-rays. They'll give me yeah. the results in a few That's days. Heck yeah. Not sure why that has to take so long. Mm -hmm. Oh hey! Don't tell anyone about me going to the hospital, right? I'm counting on you. I feel bad for always asking you to keep things quiet. Sorry about that. Alright. Well, we whiffed that uh stuff there, but a rank up is a rank up. Alright. The doctor told me to take it easy today, but we should still get to practice. No, practice oh, is over. Wait, if you're yeah. leaving, that means practice is already over. Well, guess I'll just go home. See ya. Rip. Sad to go back to the dorm. Mm. Yeah, he's got to rest. Would you mind heading to the rooftop with me? Sure. Yeah, what is it? <laughs> no need to be so wary of me. It isn't anything important. I just wanted to show you something. And okay. I just so happened to have the key to the rooftop. <laughs> now then, shall we go? New uh, social link? Do you recall fighting that shadow here on the rooftop a little while back? Yeah. Well, while cleaning up the- Oh, gardening! <laughs> I happened upon some planters and gardening tools. I couldn't help myself from setting up our own little garden. Great vegetables! So, yes! Okay. Not too shabby, huh? Uh, you like gardening? No, oh, I wouldn't say it's a hobby of mine, really. <laughs> the idea just popped into my head. I mean, look at all this space we have here. It'd be a shame not to put it to use. But, I digress. There is, in fact, a reason I brought you here. I'd right. like you to use these planters however you see fit. Although I did set them up, I'm afraid that I won't be able to tend to a garden as often as I'd like. I did mention it to Kirijo-kun, but it didn't catch on, I suppose, due to her upbringing. Besides, okay. you're able to cook meals at the dorm, correct? No, I'm not! I'm still not able to! I, I got a fake apron? I can't use the fucking kitchen! What do you mean? What do you mean, game? Well, now you can grow your own vegetables for healthy eating. And they're gonna be fucking raw! Great vegetables. Great vegetables. Yeah, sounds like a lot of work. Oh, I won't force you to work on this if you absolutely don't want to. I'm just giving you the option to do so. Come plant something whenever you feel like it. <laughs> Using the rooftop vegetable garden. At the rooftop garden, you can raise crops of vegetables. Each one will take a different amount of time to grow. You or your teammates can eat the vegetables you harvest to gain benefits that will be helpful when journeying into Tartarus. Nice. Here's some seedlings. Go ahead and plant them if you'd like. You okay. should be able to purchase other types of seedlings around the city. Feel free to experiment. All right. Well, that's everything. And now, eat your veggies, peas. Wait, I I accidentally skipped it. I forgot it was on auto, but <laughs> it's time to raise the roof and elevate this garden to new heights. And to top it off, eat your veggies, peas. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> I took psychic damage from that. <sighs> yeah, my grades were well, they were what I expected. Just leave me alone, man. Aww, it's gonna be okay, buddy. Yes. My scores on this latest round of exams were quite a bit higher than usual. I guess it's only natural, considering how I use my training time to study instead. Oh, right. Suru told me she'd be back late tonight. My mistake. So according to her, Tartarus is a no-go. Hey there. My results are actually better than I expected. It seemed like the exam didn't cover that much this time, so I kind of lucked out. I do so wish that I had enough energy to study after going to Tartarus, though. <laughs> well, I sure am glad that you agreed to take over caring for the plants. To be honest, just climbing the stairs up to the rooftop is rough for an old man like me. Old man? You ever meet people 
like Shuji, where you're like, I can't tell if you're 29 or if you're like 42. This guy, this guy is like, I'm about to be 30 years old. I'm so old, you know? <laughs> you mean like you, Caleb? Hey, 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 I have you know. <laughs> I have you know. Yes, I, I am, I am 32. But like, come on, 32, this is 32. Like, that's, that's not too bad. Like, like, all things considered, like, like, that's, that's not. <laughs> All right, all right, anyway, anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thought you were 25, to be honest. Yeah, hell yeah. I don't know what it is. I think it's good diet. I don't know, a lot of little other factors and things, and it's just, there you go. You could pass for 25. I know, I know, right? Sup, dude. Oh, Junpei, my man. Hey, how'd you do on your exams? Uh, I'm satisfied with them. What? You traitor. Dude, I'm a laughing stock. You know what I heard these two cute first year, first year girls saying? Did you see the exam results? Specifically, Iori Senpai's? He sure talks big, unlike his brain. You understand what I'm going through? My heart is in shambles. I'm not even getting a new girl on the team. No way, it's too early to give up hope. We still haven't heard back from her yet. How can we get her to join us? I should figure out what to say to convince her. Oh, poor guy. Oh, wow. We've got, oh my god, we've got everybody. Bebe is like, C'est très difficile to type. Sorry if I make any mistakes. At a school I will rate in the old way. Hello, please excuse me for contacting you without notice. I don't mean to impose, but I wonder if I could trouble you to meet after school. I'll be in front of the student council room. I hope it's not an inconvenience. Thank you. So we're gonna have like four things here. Yeah. Kenji, Kazushi, Chihiro, and Bebe. Oh, Shoto Dono. Exams have come to an end. We both fought hard. Now my brain is exhausted. Now then let us be off to the home economics room. Okay, so I need a temperance uh, persona. She's oh, justice, which I do it. have, I believe. Oh, espresso-san, exams are finally over. Um, I hope you did well in them. At least now the student council meetings can resume. Are you on your way home now? Um, would you like some company? Yeah, I don't have uh, justice oh. either. Let's go. Yes, sewing is such fun. And I shall sew to my heart's content. All right. Sew it, knit it, and finally weave it together. Ah. Today our work is done. C'est parfait. Hey. Say, could we go to the tea shop, Azuki Arai, together? It will be my first time going. Mais oui, mais oui. Maybe, oh, oh. Uh, how do you say? Show me the ropes. Hmm. Sure, let's go. Oh, you are my hero, Kataji Kanai. <laughs> Kataji. D'accord. Let's be off then. Ah, d'accord means okay. Mm. The Azuki desserts here are amazing. Red bean is so oishi. Oishi. <laughs> I love the culture of Nihon. Japan is sugoi. Amazing. <laughs> I, I totally agree. Uh, what about your country? My own has delicious food too, but... Uh, what? Japanese sweets are so good. I am in love. Daisuke. Oh, he didn't like that. Japanese culture is number yeah. one. Yeah. Ichiban. Oh, I am so happy I came here. Interesting. I want to learn everything about Nihon and become Japanese. Thank you for joining me today. I won't forget your kindness. I have an aunt who lives back home. She has been helping me. Hmm. I have to tell her that I've made a wonderful new Tamodachi. <laughs> Bebe seems really grateful. I feel like we're growing closer. Hmm. We learned something about him. He's got a negative association with France. Hmm. Oh. 
Look at the time. <laughs> but I wanted to ask you more about Nihon. I must dream a bit longer, I suppose. Aww. We'll continue our Japanese adventure another time. I'll be back. I'll be back. The follow-up with what we had before. I parted ways with Bebe and went back to the dorm. He he could he, he he brought the joke back again. I'll be back. Yeah. Kurosawa steals Kurosawa san deals in a variety of weapons for us. But my weapons, I've always got them on me. I dive right into the fray to shout the pain. These might not be as flashy as some of your weapons, but they're my pride and joy. In that case, just tell me if you ever want to fight with your fists too. I'll whip up a solid training regiment for you. I will hold you to that, Akihiko! I will absolutely hold you to that! Oh. Ah, Espresso. I saw your exam results. Good work. Here, this is from the chairman. Excellent. It's a reward for effectively balancing schoolwork as well as our <laughs> extracurricular activities. Whoa! Four incenses! Thank you so much! Whenever I look up at Tartarus, I'm always amazed at how many floors it seems to have. The tower reaches to the skies. Ah, it's going to be a long and arduous journey. Hmm. It's too bad about that girl, Fuka Namagishi, huh? Would have been nice if the girl had if a girl the same year as me joined. If you wanna go ahead, you do whatever. Where is Jimpei? Second floor. Oh! Uh, what am I doing? Damn it! I can hear Junpei yelling and shouting. Oh! Poor boy! Now practice, Yuko! Yuko! Kind of best girl already. All of them ready to rank up, see? Okay, okay. Oh, 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 hey, buddy, hey. <laughs> so this whole time there was a Persona user in the class next door, huh? Dude, we've been missing out. What if she's cute? Right, we should probably go check and see if uh, we can potentially talk to her. You seem to know Kirijo senpai. Kirijo san, huh? You're not going after her, are you? I sure am. I don't think that's a good idea since she lives in a totally different world than the rest of us. I have a feeling that if a guy tries something funny, her bodyguards will break his neck. Ah, so you have to be smart enough to get past them is what you're saying. Ho ho! Exams suck, don't they? You have to study so much and your score gets posted. And if you do bad, everyone will laugh at you. True. I heard Sana Senpai has been released from the hospital. I wonder how he got hurt anyway. No one knows. Maybe he was faking it. He was just doing it for the attention? Nah, couldn't be. He's already surrounded by girls all the time. Good logic. Flawless logic. Uh, Yuko would be a rank three, right? Yeah. Hi. Oh, hey, espresso -kun. Exams are finally over, huh? Congrats on surviving. Hopefully you're not too beat from all the studying. There's no practice today, so it's the perfect time to relax. If you're leaving, wanna hang out? Spend time with Yuko. Cool, hmm, where should we go then? Should we get something to eat? Or maybe do some karaoke? Let's decide on the way out. All right. There was this one time I left some tissues in the pocket of my running pants, and then I washed it without realizing. Oh! Why did that make a mess? That's oh, the worst. Hang on a sec while I put my shoes on. Yeah, yeah. Not again. Oh. It's the same stupid prank every time. She's getting bullied. Hmm. There's a piece of gum on Yuko's locker. Hmm. <sighs> At least my shoes are safe. Going that far would have been crossing the line. Yeah, does this happen often? After the first few times, I stopped counting. I was pissed off at first, but eventually I just got used to it. Okay. Getting worked up about this would just tire me out. It's not worth it. Yeah. But if I catch her in the act, oh. I am fully prepared to grab her and teach her a lesson. She knows who it is. Uh, that was a joke, okay? I'm a nice girl, really. <laughs> Come on, let's go. You don't have to pretend. You know who it is, and they're pissing you off. So I figured let's this would be a good time to update our team uniform. Ah. What do you think of switching to running types? They say it reduces wind resistance. Okay. Hey, look over there. It's Nishiwaki-san. Uh, oh boy. Is that your new boyfriend? Oh! oh the next one already, I see. 
Wow. Impressive, Nishiwaki-san. Oh. We're not dating. He's just a friend from the team. Yeah, get wrecked. Come on. No need to act all polite in front of him. Just tell it how it is. I'm surprised you could even get such a handsome guy. Maybe I should become a team manager too. Jeez. You got it all wrong, as usual. <laughs> Don't do it. You'll just be running around after everyone all day. And it's not very attractive for a girl to be so muscular, you know? <laughs> not so loud. Her boyfriend's like right here. I kind of feel bad for her. Oh my god. If that's really what you want to do, I won't stop you. But you're better off looking for a boyfriend elsewhere. A manager is a busy job. You won't have time to go around sticking gum on people's shoe lockers. Go tell him, Yuko! Yes! What on earth are you talking about? Tell them <laughs> off! I haven't got a clue what that means. Of course not. It was just a random example. What's wrong? Did I say something to offend you? Not at all. Hey, uh, let's just go already. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. Are you scared of a muscular girl? Sorry you got dragged into that. I don't worry about it. No, you shouldn't have to deal with that. Sorry. Oh, I should probably fill you in or you get the wrong idea about me. Let's go sit down. Okay, yeah, yeah. That girl in the black tights. We went to the same middle school. Back okay. then, there was this boy on the basketball team who asked me out, and we started dating. But turns out, he was seeing her at the same time. Oh! When she found out, she said I stole her boyfriend, even though I was a victim too. She blamed me because I was Shit. the manager of the basketball team. Isn't that just ridiculous? Yeah. And after I became the track team manager here in high school, that set her off on me again. But really, all I want to do is support others so they can be the best they can be. Yeah. Remember the gum on my locker? That was probably her doing. She's definitely the type to hold a grudge. Oh, those girls have way too much time on their hands. All they do <laughs> is complain and gossip. Why don't they do something more productive? They're the ones who should get a lecture from Akoda. You're not putting yeah, yeah. thought into your future. Tell that to them, not me. Oh, that reminds me. Sorry for what they said about you. Called you my boyfriend. Must have made you feel awkward, huh? I'm honored. Uh, hey, you! How can you say that with a straight face? And how many other girls have you used that line on, huh? When it comes to relationships, you should never play with a woman's emotions. Oh, right. Make sure you don't tell Kaz or anyone else about the two-timing thing, okay? You're the only one I've told. Oh, also, I broke up with that two-timing jerk a long time ago. Just so you know, uh, you might be thinking, so what, right? Yeah, <laughs> what am I saying? <laughs> <laughs> Yuko seems flustered for some reason. I feel like our relationship has grown. Hey! Yep. Rank three, baby. Well, that dragged on. It's late. We should be getting home. I'll see you soon. What can I say? I love the sporty girls. That, that's, that's, that's just that's just the way I am. That's just the way I am. Hey, dude, my persona just keeps getting stronger and stronger. Hell yeah, I buffed you, Jinpei. I feel like I can take on any enemy now. Okay, well, maybe not just any enemy, but but I do feel like I've gotten a lot better than before. Now, if only my grades would go up, too. Huh. huh. I guess you do have some self-awareness. <laughs> hey, don't make this serious. It's just one of those self-deprecating jokes. Uh, now I'm depressed for real. Two fives. No! Don't fall for it, Junpei! I don't care what these games writers want you to do with these puns and these for reals. Let Persona 5 stay in Persona 5. You can never escape. No! <laughs> What's up, dude? So, what do you think? Of what? Yeah. About that girl, Fuka Gamagishi. I haven't lost hope that she'll join our team. Dude, I've actually seen her around. I 
Yeah, she does look kind of frail, but that just makes me want to be strong enough for the two of us. Imagine a Persona game where the companions can have relationships with each other. Imagine. Imagine. Let's see. Today I'll be covering the Kofun period in our history. I don't know though, do any of you think this stuff's relevant? I mean, I could slap together some clay statues that look a lot better than theirs did. I can't wait until we get to the Sengoku era. It's so much more exciting. Speaking of the Sengoku era, there was this one general they called the Warhawk of the Battlefield. Oh, another Sengoku lecture. All right, nope, stay awake. I'm so Stay awake. And that's how the period came to be known as the Sengoku era. Huh? You want to hear more about the Kofun period? Well, if you insist, uh, go look up the Kitora Noom tomb in Nara. It's really famous. I went to Nara for uh, my honeymoon in Japan. It was actually pretty awesome. Got to feed deer there. They had these little like special crackers that you give them specifically for the deer there. And the deer like full on like bow to you and are like, thank you. Yes, absolutely, bow. And they're just, they're just so, so wonderful. They're the cutest things ever. I got so attached to certain ones, I started naming them after my favorite anime characters. And then there was this one, there was this one like very like violently like desiring of food. And I, I called him uh, Bakugo. I was like, Bakugo, you have to chill. You have to chill, Bakugo. Like you, 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 know, you just move, move to the side over here. Yeah, if you bow to deer, they bow back. Yep, it's, tr it's real. Uh, so polite, they even wait to cross the street with other people. They'll sit at the crosswalk with people and be like, is it time to cross? And then once the people go to cross, they'll cross with you. Probably time to advance Chihiro a little bit, you know. Um, we don't have a justice persona though. So we could wait, I guess. Yeah, let's wait a little bit and spend time with Kazushi. Oh, go on without me again, okay. Spend time with them, yeah. Hmm. I got you. See you in a bit. Let everyone know that too. Let everyone know that too, would you? I'm not skipping or anything. Okay. Last one. Go for it. Don't see Miyamoto today either. Oh shit. Whoa. And I keep running into you at the weirdest times. Oh, buddy. Back from the hospital. You remembered what we talked about last time. Nothing gets past you, eh? Yeah. So, yeah. I just got back from the hospital. They had the results from my last exam. And, well, I. Oh no. Ah! Yeah. You gotta be kidding. Why can't I let me stand? Let up? me help you. Take my shoulder. Take my shoulder. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah, Thanks. yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Yeah, yeah. Funny, huh? Well, from just crouching down to tie my shoes. Good thing you were around. If it were anyone else, then the rest of the team would have found out. Yeah. Thanks, man. Really grateful to have you as a friend. Oh. He really seems to appreciate me. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Yeah, that fucking sucks. Ah. Oh. All right. I'm gonna go train by myself. Even if practice is over, no! I can't skip out on training. Big meat's not that far off. Bro, You're you can't home, even right? stand up. Then we'll train together next time. Take it easy. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, you dumbass! Yeah, Yamero! <laughs> it's strange. The number of apathy syndrome victims seems to be on the rise again. Evidently, the prior decline was only temporary. Huh? If that's the case, then what's the point of fighting? No. If you do nothing, then everyone will eventually join the lost. Our efforts have prevented the crisis from escalating to that point. Yeah. Yeah, I guess you're right. I'd hate to see what the city would be like if we couldn't use our personas. Uh oh, foreshadowing? This persona is powerful. Wait. Oh. 
they'll literally just get Matsuya right there. And then we can just buy back Jack Frost, yeah. Magic, what do you so wish to inherit? I guess it doesn't really matter. Let's just do Kalumpa. And then Rakunda, I guess. Oh, we have to do another one. Oh, then Dodge Slash, sure. It seems you have been... My name is Oberon. Oh, let me guess, you need my power, right? The power of the Fairy King. I need your Matsio. Lend me your electricity. Oh, more damage on closer to a new moon. Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. That's a fun mechanic there. Oh, a skill seems to be on the verge of changing. Will you see this through? It looks like it's gonna be Zeo and Rakunda. I mean, yes, absolutely. All right, I manifest Marakunda and, oh, uh, let's also get, what what is a uh, higher, uh, Zionga? Yeah, Zionga and Marakunda. Send it. Oh, wait, wait, okay. This is actually really good. This is, this is really good. AOE one to two that I can pass along but also an auto skill. And I'm about to get another auto skill from something else there again and then pass that those along into a strength, you know, base persona. Ooh. Okay, okay. Have you heard? I heard from a younger guy in my club yesterday that a second year is getting bullied. Huh? That's crazy. Which second year? I don't know. All I heard is that it's pretty serious. I thought our school was peaceful, but I guess stuff like that still happens here. Seems like someone in the same grade as me is getting bullied. Hmm. Hmm. All right, all right. Right now, class, it's time to begin today's lecture. Progredio adio lucum sidera. I'm changing today's lecture to another integrated learning one, since Mr. Okuda, Ekuda left early today. He claimed he wasn't feeling well. Looked fine enough to me, though. Quick word of caution, make sure you know what you're eating before you take a bite. <laughs> I covered the basics of learning magic last time, so maybe I'll go a little bit deeper into meditation. First, let's review the ways that magicians can well meditate. To heighten the creative impulse, the source of all your magical power. Observe a real world object carefully, and recreate it in your mind down to the last tiny detail. That's the Western standard for meditation, but I'd like to talk about the Eastern style as well. Meditation was originally refined in the East, and modern magicians adapted Eastern meditation for their own original style. You find the right posture, take a deep breath in and out, and calm your mind. That's the basic practice of the Eastern style. It doesn't take much to practice meditation either. All you need is some free time in a relatively calm environment. It doesn't take long, but you should give yourself at least 15 minutes for a proper session. Now for the specifics. First, your posture. Just take a position that you find comfortable, okay? Sitting cross-legged is good enough for most, but you can try the full lotus position too. It's sometimes called kakafusa. You can even meditate while sitting in a chair. <gasps> I'm in a chair! Any position works as long as it's comfortable. Once your breathing is relaxed, close, recover your eyes, and the let the rest of your body relax too. Now that you've prepared yourself physically, you'll focus next on your mind and soul. Imagine a symbol, some simple image, perhaps a large tree, or the moon! Foreshadowing! You could even be the god of your own faith, if you like. However, do not force yourself to fully empty your mind. That's actually a common misconception. Most people aren't even fully capable of it, but succeeding is especially dangerous. You run the risk of losing all control of yourself. Hmm? The moon? God? In my JRPG? Hmm? Stay awake. That is to say. So what have we learned? Meditation can be aided through iconography, rather than forcing an empty mind. Even Christian prayer can reach a level of meditation if practiced fervently enough. Although in that case, the imagined symbol is present for a reason other than meditational aid. It can be dangerous to plumb the depths of your consciousness. By keeping a clear symbol in mind, you avoid teetering over the edge and plunging into the darkness. Go ahead and try meditating tonight, if you'd like. All right, that's it for today. Hmm. I can't believe we actually learned something. Mr. Enagawa was definitely on some government's watch list somewhere. <laughs> yes. <sighs> what a workout. Oh. 
I gotta teach those first years how to clean up properly. Oh no, she's the one getting bullied. <laughs> yeah. Hmm? So then, I pretended to take a picture with my cell phone, and she totally freaked out and started crying. It was like we caught her red-handed or something. You should have seen the look on her face. Oh, shit. It was priceless. Wow, that's pathetic. Okay, maybe it's not Ikari. I've never laughed so hard in all my life. Maybe it's the Yamagishi girl? <laughs> yeah. They're making fun of someone? Bullies. Huh? Did you hear a voice? <laughs> it's calling me. Wait, what? Huh? What voice? I don't hear anything. Wait, what? Oh. Uh, Maki? What's going on? Are you listening to me? Maki? Hello? Uh... Oh. Huh? Are you feeling all right? Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Uh, what were we talking about? They're finally gone. Ugh, I can't stand girls like that. Hmm. Class is over. Sewing is fun. Yes, very simple. Greetings. Oh, Shototono, how do you do? You have the time to spare. Would you care to join me for sewing? Let's go. I must sew. Many thanks, Kadaji Kanai. You have a great sense for sewing, Shototono. Please do show me more of your skills today. So, so down, so all around. If the Koku doesn't sew, then I will show it. We should take a break for now. A break? You have gotten much better at this. Subarashi! Subarashi! <laughs> yes! Ah! Oh! Is he the kind of person that likes to be just generally like... No, he likes enthusiasm, so I can do better. Yes. Ooh, oh. so humble. That is very admirable. Kanshin. <laughs> By the way, I have a question for you. I ah. would like to make something Japanese, but what? Ah. Um, how about a kimono? Oh, what do you like kind of... Yeah, let's 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 invite him to tell us. Yeah, what do you like? I do have something in mind, but yes, it has to be a kimono. But uh, kimonos are very hard to make. I don't. So really I should have suggested it. Oh, and the material Damn it. is not exactly affordable. Hmm. I have to think about it. But I appreciate the advice. You are the only one I can talk to here in this country. As long as I have you, I will be okay. Daijoubu. Baby seems pretty grateful. Yeah, we might rewind. I, that feels kind of silly that he's like, oh, the kimono, the same thing that I was gonna do there, but okay. Oh, la, la, look at the time. I must make my way home now. I'll be back. I'll be back. Hey, so God, I hate bullying. Even seeing, just seeing it happen to someone else, it feels just as bad. I feel the same. Yeah. Right? I overheard these girls talking to, today, talking about how they were picking on someone. I couldn't tell who they were talking about or anything, though. I wish I could do something. Yeah. Hey, sorry for the sudden invite, but I'm thinking about getting something to eat right now. Do you want to join me? I'm in front of you want to die station. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Let's go, bro! Let's fucking go! Hey, what's up, man? Yo, espresso. You see my text message? Wanna go grab a bite? Sonata's invited me to join him. This might be a good opportunity to get to know him better. Hell yes! We'll spend time with him. Great. Let's go. I've gotten a lot of my edge back since right. I've been able to focus ah. on my training. I've been meaning to thank you for that. You've really stepped up as our leader. So tonight's on me. You've got enough responsibility as it is. All right. Good, I'm starving. <laughs> <laughs> so 
So you've got talent and an appetite. I think you'd make a pretty good athlete. Just don't push yourself too hard. Things will get easier with experience. And if you need anything, let me know. I'll do whatever I can to help. You the man. Uh, excuse me. Oh, I knew it. Oh my Here's gosh. From Gekko Khan High. I heard you lived in Iwa Todai. But wow, I never thought I'd run into you here. We're big fans of yours. Please, can we get a picture with you? I'm busy, and I don't like having my picture taken. I kept hearing rumors that you were injured. Uh, are you okay now? Do you need any help? I is there anything I can bring you? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wh who do you think that is? <gasps> I'm not sure. Celebrity, maybe? Want to go see? <laughs> Let's go. Wait, Sonata's on! Oh, they even voice acted the unscripted lines. Oh, that was awesome. I've had this problem at school, but I didn't think it happened out here, too. It's probably because of those interviews. Or the rumors online. I've gotten all kinds of attention as I've kept up my winning streak. Ah, I gotcha. Sounds rough. <laughs> you could say that again. I'm not some panda in a zoo for everyone to gawk at. All I want is to be as strong as I can. I want to train hard and feel real pride in my strength. But all, all right. I ever seem to get is more trouble. All right. Looks like they've given up. Let's head out to eat. For real this time. Ah! We only have so many hours left in the day. Troop, troop. He is pretty cool, yeah. Hey, don't be like that. I know a place that'd be perfect for us, girl. Oh my god. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Please, just leave us alone. We're not interested. One I think that was Chie's That's voice all we're actress. Asking. Come on, it'll be fun. Alright, let's beat we him up. Said no, okay? Ah, those girls from earlier. Hey. Hey. Yeah. Leave them alone. You don't want the police to get involved, do you? Huh? Who the hell are you? Yeah. Nice. What? You want to call the cops? Quit trying to act like a big man, you little punk. Yeah. Time for you to piss off. Huh? You piece of. Swing and a miss. Hold up. You got some slick moves. Bet you know how to fight, all right? That's right. So what if I do? How about you and I go a few rounds? If you ain't too busy, there's a spot around back. Oh shit! Whenever I see guys who think they're hot shit, all I want to do is put them in their place. I bet a lot of people call you a tough guy. So how about we put it to the test? Oh no! They got him where he's weakest. His battle sexuality. Oh, he's scared now. <laughs> See? I told you. Nothing but trouble. Stay here. I'll be done in a minute. No, buddy! What? You think you're gonna beat me just like that? But don't worry. I won't go all out against an amateur. It's gotta be a fair fight. Ha ha ha! Hey! Over there! Break it up! Uh. <sighs> Let's beat it. I told you, officer. They were the ones antagonizing us. And I told you we'll hear all about it down at the station. Oh my god! You're high school students, aren't you? We'll need your contact information to notify your parents about this. Are you kidding me? In. Yes! Kurosawa! Let's go! And Kurosawa-san? Yes! I'll handle these two. I've already cleared it with the brass. I don't know what's going on here, but you better not be starting any trouble. Oh, there was no trouble. Then why'd we get a report from two ladies saying you were attacked by a group of punks? They wanted to test my strength. I was just giving them what they wanted. In the middle of a public street? You really need to think things through. 
Listen, I'm an officer of the law. I don't care who you are. Anyone who disturbs the peace is gonna have to deal with me. All right. As you can see, your friend here is a bit of a hothead. I no know shit. it won't be easy, but try and keep an eye on him, would you? I got it. Leave it to me. Those are some bold words. But thing. My arm's healed, then we've got way more dependable people now. There's no better time to test my strength. All especially right. Especially now that we have someone like you. We really lucked out on that one. So yeah, I'm Akiko saving Akihiko, yep. That way, I can put down anyone I face with my own two hands. <laughs> you really haven't changed at all. In any case, don't get in over your heads. I have a hunch the guys you ran into were from a gang that's been active around here recently. Just be careful. You don't want to get on their bad side, because once you're on it, you'll never get off. All right, ah, shit. it's late. You better head on home. Oh, no. Akihiko's stories are gonna be all, like, so Yakuza related. It's been non-stop interruptions all night. Disturbs the peace? <sighs> right, the music! <laughs> we should probably head home. Mm. Sorry about this. I'll treat you some other time. I'm gonna do some jogging on the way back. You wanna join? Hell yeah. Good answer. It's dark, so watch out for cars. I'm gonna run ahead. You just follow at your own pace. All right. I ran back to the dorm. I feel like my stamina has improved after running that long of a distance. Hell yeah. Max HP, baby. Good stuff. Um, hey. Uh, hey, have you heard about that second year? Yep, yep. Oh yeah, that one they found lying in front of the school gate this morning, right? Hopefully she just ran away from home. But I feel like this is the start of something big. You know what? Yeah, there might be reporters and camera crews and stuff. I'd rather not deal with that. Ooh, ooh, big plot stuff about to happen. Hey, did you hear about that girl in 2E? Oh, voice actor too. Yeah, I heard they have no idea what happened. Oh shit, oh, oh shit. Oh my God, isn't it so bizarre? <laughs> Man, everyone's talking about it. People sure got a lot of time on their hands. So, you hear about it too? Yeah. I'm not interested. <laughs> what, you think you're one of them cool city slickers? Come on, you gotta keep up with stuff like this. A girl from 2E went missing while she was out late last night. Oh. This morning, they found her lying in front of the school gate. Oh. Nobody knows what happened. And supposedly, she's still unconscious. P4 flashbacks. P4 flashbacks. Oh. Yo. You can oh tell. no. Man, this is a tough oh, no. case. Even for Junpei Yori, Ace Detective. Ace Detective. <laughs> Ace Detective? You're so dumb. Hmm. More like stupid Ace Defective. Ah! Got him. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Oh, that's, that's, that's great. Wow. Where'd that come from? She'd been Actually, working on that for I a while. I haven't seen you all morning. Where you been? I was talking to the teacher. And okay. that girl they found? I saw her yesterday on my way back from practice. Oh, she seemed yeah. just fine then. Okay. Huh. The plot thickens. The plot does indeed thicken. I heard a girl from class two being fainted. Apparently it was apathy syndrome. Kind of scary, huh? How do you know about apathy syndrome? Clearly a very well-informed student. She'd always stay out late, right? I bet she just happened to faint at the school gates. Apathy syndrome is so exaggerated. She'll probably wake up soon. What? Why are they saying that like it's something like everybody knows about it? It's on the news and stuff? Oh, really? Wait, that's actually like very weird. Cause that means someone coined the phrase. Interesting, interesting. You were interrupted last time, so if you're down, wanna try hanging out again? Yeah, let's spend time with you, Kyle. <laughs> Great, let's head to town and have some fun. How about we head to Polonia Mall? Maybe we can get some cake from Chagall, too. Okay. Oh, yeah. Have you been training to strengthen your core? Oh, are you been noticing my abs? It's a good idea if you wanna shorten your runtime. You're less likely to injure yourself, too. 
I was talking with Kaz about putting it in the first year's practice routine, actually. Nice. Good stuff. Do you mind if we continue talking in the cafe? I'm a little hungry. Oh, shit! Oh. Is it this random kid again? You again. Yeah! You little shit! You know, it's dangerous to be running around a place like this. You're lucky it's just me. But what if you bumped into a scary man, huh? If you want to play, do it at your schoolyard. We can't play there. The sixth graders are always hogging everything by playing soccer. Aww. They said they'll move if we can beat them in a race, but we're only fourth graders. Oh. No way we could win. That's why we had to play tag here instead, Auntie Yuko. I'll let the anti slide this time, but only because I feel sorry for you. All okay. Right, come with me. This field is so big. Wow, high school is amazing. Yeah. They said it's fine for us to use the schoolyard for a bit. Normally, you wouldn't be allowed in here. Understand? So don't touch anything you're not supposed to, and if something happens, let us know immediately. Can you promise that? We promise. Oh. Good. Then you goes until awesome. The big hand on that clock reaches twelve, and don't go inside the school building. All right, let's do this. Whoa! Look at them run. Wait, come here for a second. You're running wrong. Yep. We teach you some form. You need to pump your arms yep. more. Yep. I was and don't lift say. your legs so high, or you might pull a muscle. Come on, give it a try. You just gotta believe in yourself. Woohoo! Check this out. Yeah. Wow, Kenchon, you're so fast. Hey, big sis, you should be our coach. Oh, I'm a real sucker when kids look at me that way. But I've never tried coaching before. What do you hey. think I should do? Yeah, why not give it a go? Yeah. Really think I should? Yeah, hey, yeah. Come on, please. Yeah, why not? Please. Hmm. Well, it isn't a decision to make lightly. Be your coach, but I'm not gonna go easy on you guys, and no one's allowed to quit halfway either. Got it? All right. Got it, Coach Yuko. Coach Yuko. Hey, is he gonna teach us too? Is he your boyfriend, Coach? <gasps> oh, Never doing this again. That. Now everyone, line up. I said I wouldn't go easy on you, didn't I? Yuko began passionately instructing each child. Think positive. If you think you're gonna lose, you will. Don't be afraid of them just because they're sixth graders. Yeah, yeah. That sounds hard, but okay. <laughs> Watch you go, she coached the kids. Eventually they all went home. Once they started calling me coach, I couldn't resist. I know, they're so cute. Hey, um, I was wondering, would you maybe want to do this coaching thing together? I know I'm asking a lot, but I don't know much about racing. And plus, you're really athletic, too. So if you'd coach them with me, I'd really appreciate it. Absolutely. I mean, why not, right? <laughs> Please? Honestly, I don't think I can handle it on my own. All right, sure thing. Oh, thank goodness. I'm sure those kids will be happy, too. Thanks. Seems like Yuko is counting on me. I feel like our relationship has grown. OK. Nice. Rank four. I know that I keep asking you for favors, but I'll make it up to you one day. All right, all right. Left school with Yuko and return to the dorm. Okay. What's the romance plans for this playthrough, if I ask? No plans. Figure it out as I go. Fantastic. It seems Takabakun has a sixth sense when it comes to shadows. Actually, that's quite common. Dealing with shadows has a tendency to enhance other senses. Oh, right. Apparently Tartarus is off limits today. Mitsuru's in training and Takaba has a bad feeling right now. Shh. 
There should be any more mysterious about it. Hmm. Yeah. Let's go to her room. Oh, she's just hanging out of here. Oh my god, Stupe, shut up. Now I'm never gonna get to sleep tonight. All right. Well, I guess I should take responsibility and come by your room tonight to check on you and... What? And what exactly? Do I need to call the police? Or better yet, Kirijo Senpai? What? Well, wait, wait! I was gonna say and sing you a lullaby! It was just a joke! Of course. Mm -hmm. You could dance freaking out for no reason. All I said to her was that someone might be in her room or under her bed or in her closet. I mean, come on, there's nothing to get all worked up about, right? Uh, I, that's scary, actually. Huh? Wait, seriously? All she'll probably see is one of those big-ass cockroaches. Well, I guess that would be pretty scary, too. No. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Mutatsu and Tanaka? Oh, no. I don't... I'm falling behind, yeah. All right, Sunday time. Got a text message. Guess who's bored? No school and no track practice? Guess that means we gotta go somewhere fun. Let's hang out. Oh. Hmm. Well, I'm definitely not full up with Yuko as far as uh, points go. She's definitely not gonna be ready to rank up the next time we hang out with her. So let's go, let's go spend time with her. Yep. Let's go meet up with Yuko. Sorry. I'm so sorry about the other day. I shouldn't have forced you to be a coach. Today's on me. Eat as much as you want. Yuko seems motivated. Um... You know, I've kind of been second-guessing my decision. Maybe I should have thought about it more carefully before agreeing. Sure, I'm team manager and all, but I don't know if I'm ready to be a coach. What do you think? Um... She's feeling motivated, though. Now, ah, we'll, we'll encourage her. You're very responsible. Thank you. Ah, uh, there we go. Thanks, I really appreciate that. I'm gonna read up on how to get better at running. I mean, I want those kids to win. Yuko seems very happy. I feel like we became a lot closer today. All right. Well, I better get my daily nutrients too. Do let's talk for a while longer before I head back to the dorm. Oh, meet sort of, what are you doing back there? What's up, dude? Hmm? Something the matter? Honestly. This incident is quite troubling. As the student council president, I need to do something. Though it doesn't help that I have no idea what's really going on. Seriously? Yeah, rumors spread fast. Especially this one. Everyone at school knows about it. And soon everyone in town will too. Hmm. We're gonna be a little bit nervous. If you're looking for Mitsuru, she's in the back of the reception area. Apparently she's uploading the dorm's records or something to the school server. She's gotta do it every so often. I know it's her job, but still, she's really got a lot on her plate. Dorm records? Uh, records of what? And uploading? You usually only upload something that actually takes some amount of time to upload. Hmm. The girl they found was one of those girls I overheard talking about bullying someone. It's probably unrelated, though. Are you espresso kun? Let's ask the eight detective. <laughs> yes! <sighs> what? Oh, oh, you're talking about Junpei. Ugh. Seriously, he's such an idiot. Hey! 2009 internet? 2009 internet was not that slow. Actually, actually, hold on. You know what's the most unrealistic thing about this? This computer does not have an actual computer. This is just a monitor. It's a shadow computer. <gasps> Destroy it, Mitsuru! Destroy it! Cast it into the fire! Isildur! This one. You want to use the computer? Good timing, I just finished my own business. Feel free to use it. Let me see what this URL leads to. Moonlight channel looks like an unofficial forum from Gekko Gun High. Topics include things like third years only and who do you think is hot? Seems like the newest topic is... Anyone try the Taiyaki at the school store? I'll take a look at this. Never seen this on sale. Why is there such a limited amount? I saw someone complain to the vendor about this. Good news, the Taiki's gonna be a permanent item now. I asked about it and apparently there were a lot of requests for it. Sounds like they'll have it in stock daily now. Wait, so we can seriously get it when Ebbs now? 
I'm gonna get one. <laughs> Someone just named Odo Nubanaga. Seems like a special Tayati will be available at the school store. Oh. Huh. That's nice. I guess. Switching to the summer uniform today. All right. Yeah. We do have Oberon, so we should be good here. Yeah. Spend some time, yeah. Okay. Spent some time working with the student council. Hours flew by as I worked hard on my tasks. Thanks for all your hard work today. Well then, please excuse me. Oh, can I borrow you for a moment? I'd like to hear your opinion on something. It's nothing serious, but some students think the school uniform should be abolished and they're gathering supporters. What? Sounds like nonsense. Yes, because it is nonsense. Yeah. They think freedom is a life without rules. It's ridiculous, plain and simple. Without rules, the whole system will collapse. <laughs> They're mistaking selfishness for freedom. Okay, okay. Sorry, overreacted a bit there. I hate people with no common sense. I have very little desire to talk to them. And okay, don't take that good the to know. Way. I just want you to understand where I'm coming from. I think Odagiri's starting to trust me. I think we'll become better friends. Wait, what? That was a rank up? <laughs> Imagine if we're like, wait, but they maybe have a point. And he's like, now nah, I'm not even going to do your social link. Bye. You know? <laughs> Why don't you head on home? I'll lock up here when I'm You've become a rank safe, zero with Emperor. Left the student council room and went back to the dorm. Yeah, maybe they have a point? Fuck you. <laughs> yes. Oh shit, here we go. Hey, you could tie. You ever check out the student message boards and stuff? You know how last week that girl was found by the front gate? Well now, they're saying it was an angry spirit from this one ghost story that did it. Everyone's Come in their on, summer uniforms. Nobody really believes that stuff. Right? What's this ghost story about? What? It's probably made up. We don't need to go into details, do we? She's scared, yeah. Go on, tell us. Yeah, Yukari's you mm -hmm. scared, yeah. You got it. Here goes. Here goes. All right. Oh, shit! Let's go! Good evening, and welcome to Junpei's <laughs> Believe It or Don't. Uh -huh. There are many strange things in this world. Uh -huh. Legend has it, late at night, after everyone has gone home, a maniacal ghost roams the halls and devours anyone caught in its grasp. The other day, this friend of mine, let's call him Witness A. Anyway, uh. he said to me, Hey, Iori, I saw something weird the other day. Ooh. He sounded so serious. So I asked him what he'd seen. What he'd seen. He told me. He saw the girl from 2E and claims he watched her go into the school on the night before the incident. Ah! I told him, I don't believe it. Not even for a second. <laughs> the deep voice. girl from 2E ain't the type to go wandering around at night. But witness A was as white as a sheet. He swore to me was true. Then it hit me. Uh. If the girl was found unconscious at school, then maybe the ghost really did make her its dinner. It all made sense. She went to the school at night and walked right into its deadly trap. I felt a chill run down my spine and I broke into a cold sweat. Uh. Yes, there truly are some strange things in this world. Believe it or don't. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Flawless game. What do you think, Akihiko? Persona 3. Goaded. Seriously? Not Junpei, goaded. My amazing performance just now? I'm, I'm applauding you, Junpei. I'm not so interested yep. in the ghost part, but it does sound like it's worth investigating. 
So, Claps in chat. Yep. To go, huh, Yukata? Didn't know you were such a chicken. What? Who are you calling a chicken? Fine then. Let's investigate it. Each of us will ask around for the rest of the week and gather information. Okay. This ghost story's just a bunch of nonsense. I'll show you. Sounds good to me. The story is a bit unnerving, isn't it? Hmm. Huh? No. Well, leave it to you guys then. All right. Would have been too scary for me. <laughs> what? <laughs> well played. Well played. Let's see. If Takaba won't go to Tartarus tonight, perhaps it'd be better to go when everyone can join us. But I have to admit I'm a bit curious about these supposed hauntings. Oh? Yukari seems pretty serious. Well, it's good to be that invested in things. If you're free, how about lending her a hand? Oh, goodness, no. Hmm. This isn't good. We're getting a lot of inquiries from parents and reporters alike. Nah, no, let's just eat the special meal here. Just pump that academics, baby. Oh, oh, oh shit. Oh shit. Stuff's going down. Good evening. Oh, you again? I'm back just as I promised. How have you been? Hey, yeah, it's you. Hi. I'm glad you remember me. <laughs> In another week, the moon will be full again. The next ordeal will be upon you. Be careful. Until next time. <laughs> Morning. Hey. I'm just gonna do my best from today onwards. With what? Hey, listen. A ghost story, duh. Did you already forget what we talked about last night? Well, whatever. I'm gonna look into everything there is about our, about it. Remember, we'll share our findings on Friday. Did you also try gathering information too, Espresso Kun? Like maybe you could talk to some students after school. Okay, sure, we'll give it a shot. So, ah, this, this phrase, Monosusumajiku, also appears in Ugetsu Monogatari. Of all the Ugetsu tales, I'm most fond of the one about the vengeful ghost wife. Such an eerie yet poignant story, speaking of which, I've got a pretty good ghost story of my own. Care to hear it? I'm feeling sleepy. Did I close my eyes for a few minutes? No, stay awake! Yes, precisely! Oh, then, my friend, the one who came with me into the tunnel suddenly screamed! There's a girl behind you! We ran back home, scared out of our wits. But not long after that, I started hearing the strangest thumping noises coming from inside the wall. And the faintest voice croaking. Let me out! Let me out! As far as I knew, that room had always been vacant. It was in my wall. So one night, I decided to go right up to the wall where the sound came from and knock on it. <laughs> All of a sudden, right in my ear, I hear this girl's voice loud and clear. I'm here! And that's where the youngest member of my family came from. She grew up to be just like any ordinary human, though. Nowadays, I only lie awake in fear that she'll run off and marry this loser she's been seeing. <laughs> Oops, there's the bell. Okay, class, that's all for today. What? What? <laughs> it's baby. Shotodono, come to the Omek room, please. I need to tell you something. I'll wait in the hallway. Oh, no, he's sad. The baby. The baby is sad. Hey. Did you find anything about the ghost story? I'm going to prove to everyone that it was just a rumor. And I'm not scared, all right? Yeah, totally not scared. Those can be creepy. But they don't have to be, right? There was a ghost that looked like a cute girl. I wouldn't mind being haunted by it. Well, as long as she doesn't deserve our my soul or something. Right. Did you hear? I heard. Of course you would have heard. That any man who hopes to get with Kirijo Senpai would have to be as intelligent as she is. Yep. Um, uh, Shoto Dono. Will you be joining me today? There is something I must tell you. I am most great. Many, many thanks. And now, away we go. Mm. Oh, he's not feeling good. What's going on? <sighs> Are you all right? Oh. oh. Mm. So you noticed. Uh, last night. Oh, no. My aunt. She, oh. Uh, oh, shit. She was taken by the angels. Oh! 
Oh, that's terrible. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. This sweet boy. I'm sorry. He lost you a were not member. expecting to deal with this. My aunt was the reason I was able to come to Japan. And now she's been taken away. Oh. She helped me so much, but I could not do anything for her. I tried holding it all inside. I felt that crying would not help me. But when I saw the look on your face, I... Uh... Maybe they lost someone very important to him. I can tell he's really opened up to me. Oh. Yeah, sorrow piano, yeah. Forgive me, but I cannot sew today. I am going home. Well, I'll be back. Oh, oh, I even tried to do the I'll be back. <laughs>